yeah, my name's Marie, and you're watching Marie's Stuff. So, how you doing? Have you done something fun yet? Well, let's do something fun together. Like, have a go at this wolf in a moon. Um, mold. <laughs> oh, I'm starting strong today, aren't I? Okay, I've selected some colours to go in it. I'm going to use UV resin. Um, I've got some glitters. I've got silver and iron grey. I've got uh, brown pigment, black pigment, white pigment and some pearlescence. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, I think... Gonna give it a go, I think. Yeah. Right. Get my resin out. Get my little cups out. I think I'm gonna start by dusting some of the. I'm gonna start by dusting some of the. Um, glitters in there. <laughs> I know they don't dust in there too well, but I, I just want a bit of sparkle, not like mega. I'm going to put some in the, um, I might put some in the thingy anyway, but let's just, yeah, let's just put a bit in there, isn't it? Yeah, just let it fall where it falls. <laughs> Do some of this iron grey as well and just streak it through. Oh, I haven't opened this one. Just opening it. Oh, no, that's the top bit. Okay. There we go. Well, right, I'll be back. I'm struggling with this. See you in a second. Right, I've got it open and I'm back. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Right, let's do a bit of this left on his mouth and streaking through, mixing with this one. And we'll do a bit of this on the feet, the legs, and backside. <laughs> Whoops, I just put it all in the moon. That's clever, Marie. I'll get it out now. But yeah, I think that'll look nice. Okay, right, let me just get some wet wipes and get that load that I put in down there. Okay. Ah, oh, this stuff is not easy to get out. <laughs> I might just put some, just a dab of silver here and there on the moon as well, actually. Just do that. Just not all the way, just streaks. Mind you, I could put a little bit of grey in there as well, couldn't I? Just for the yeah, go on, we're going to do a bit of grey as well. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing, can you tell? I'm just having a play. And I hope you all have a play now and again, just to, you know, liven things up. And so you're not so stuck in what you're, do, what you're doing. You need to have some variety of life, isn't it? Bit of variety of life never hurts anyone. Hey. Oh look, I just took that out and now I've put it back in. Oh well. <laughs> right, there we go. Okay, so now I've done that, what colour am I gonna do? I think I'm gonna stick with the the white and the brown. I don't think I'm going to go black and I am going to put a little pearlescence in it. 
Right, here we go. Let's get some of these in here and see what we can do. Okay. And yes, I should be wearing gloves and I hope you guys do wear gloves. Um, but my hands are super sore today. So I'm not managing to. Okay. All right, let's shake these up. Still see what I'm doing, can't you? Just about. Okay. I'm very careful to keep it off my hands, and I've got wet wipes right here so that I can clean my hands straight away if there's any problem. But, right, I don't want a lot. I can add more if I want to, but for, I just want to, I don't want it to be mega, mega dark. I just want it to be like a coffee colour. Or a very, very weak coffee colour, if you see what I mean. Yeah, do you know what? I think that's... I might go a, a dab darker, maybe. Yeah, just a dab. Just barely a drop. squeezing the bottle at all. Just letting that go. There we go. Probably too much now, but we'll see. There we go. Right. Yeah, that's, that's kind of what I wanted. Yeah. Right, that's the colour for the wolf. Is that done? Now we want some nice white pigment. Oh, do you know what? I've done the wrong blooming thing. That should have been the white and this one should have been the brown. Oh well, I'll, you know, put some more in this one. <laughs> Mistakes can be fun. They all they all give you different blooming results. As the great late Bob Ross says, happy little accidents. Right, okay. Let's get this white well shook up. There we go. Let's mix this all together. be able to see the iridescent. I think you can. Just about. Let's get this mixed up fully. I just because you're going to have sh all shimmer on the front, I just wanted a little bit on the back as well. That's why I've put the iridescent in. Let's see how it goes. Right. Yeah, I think that's exactly how I want it. Just about see the iridescent in there. Can you? Yeah, I think so. Right, let me. Okay. What I'm going to do is move everything out of the way so I've got clear space. I'm going to pour the white into the moon and the brown into the f uh, wolf. having to do two layers of this. 
that's about as much as I would like to. It's about the th thickness that I'm happy to um, I need more white though. So you stay there. I need more white palescents. Eek. I didn't do enough of that. I knew I should have done that. <laughs> Never mind, I did plan on doing it the other way round. I don't mind the white going into the brown, but I don't want the brown going into the white, if you see what I mean. So let's mix all this up nice and quickly. I can see that blooming brown creeping into the white again. Right, get back round, get back round, get, get, get. Get back around. Thank you. Right. Here we go. Let that go back down, but I want to put this in here. I want to let this even out. Right, okay. That's enough. I'm just going to streak some of this white into the, I think I'll use some of this and just streak it in there. There we go. I just want some streakies in there. I'm going to set that now because I'm happy with that. Okay, let me move these out of the way. Turn this over here and set this. Right, I'll be back when it's set. Right, I'm back. This is all set. It's nice and hard. I did it in like 10 second blasts. Quite a few, but kept making sure it cooled down so that it didn't all curl up. So let's have a go. Let's see if I can fill this up with just one more there. I have to put a bit more white in. That's uh, the wool filled, but I definitely need to add more white in. Okay, no problem. I'll just um, right. Put a couple of these under so that the wolf doesn't um, go all into the moon. Right, let's put a bit more of this white in. Oops, that's enough. Okay, oh, sorry, <laughs> bash the arm then. Right. Okay. Get this 
this mixed up and hopefully this should be it. go back in there. And I'm just gonna put some up here as well. There we go. There we go, I think that moon's filled up quite well. I'm going to finish this off and I'll be back for the fun bit of demolding. <laughs> See you in a second. Right, here we go. It's all done. It's all set, I believe. So let's demold. Well, it's caught the glitter because there's none left in the mould, so that's good. See what it looks like, you ready? Oh, oh, wow! Oh, I like that. I think I might put some magnets on it and use it as a fridge magnet. What do you think? Oh, I do like that. Yeah, considering I wasn't sure what I was going to do and did it all on the fly, that is pretty nice. That is definitely pretty nice. Yep, yeah, I like that. Okay, that's it. I hope you liked the video. And thanks for watching. <laughs> See you next time. Well, that's everything. Thank you for watching my video. If you liked it, Please like and subscribe. If you didn't, let me know how I can improve in the comments section below. Please be kind, I'm not a professional. So, just remember, when you take away all the squishy parts, we're all just skeletons, aren't we? Try being kind to each other. Thanks for watching.